Have you ever wondered where second-hand mitumba clothes come from? Well, most of these clothes come through the sea from abroad and were given out as donations. But once they touch ground, it's another booming business. These clothes are no longer given out to people as an act of charity. They are sold, but at a reasonable low price compared to if you bought the same cloth new from the shop. Most people prefer to buy second-hand clothes because first of all they are cheap and secondly they are of quality. So this is devoid of them being worn before. So this is how a second-hand open-air market would look like here in Africa. Then we have second-hand clothes also sold in stores like this one. All this is second-hand clothes arranged neatly and ready for sales. So here is another section of more of these clothes. And there is variety. You can find clothes fitting all different age groups, from the young kid to an adult. You'll also find designs of every kind. Jeans, jackets, you name it. This is in a pretty good state. So second-hand clothes are either sold in an open-air market or a thrift store, just like I showed you. So the second-hand clothes are not necessarily of low quality because someone has worn them before. Some of them are of very high quality, which is retained regardless of uh, the length of period they've lasted. The mere fact that they are cheap and affordable makes it a darling to most people here in Kenya. Guys, got some corn or maize uh, from the market and I'm set to prepare this for breakfast. So I'll boil and some I'll spice up to make the breakfast a little bit interesting. So watch and learn and you can decide to try this recipe and let me know how, how it goes.
how was it guys thank you so much for watching if you are new here welcome so much if you are returning subscriber you know how much you mean the world to me many thanks if you found the video helpful consider subscribing bye and see you on the next one